um, so to renew or install SSL certificates on the Linode servers, you come to this link, um, setbots.org slash let's encrypt. So I will add the link in the comment of this video. So you come to the link. So from the link, you then select the web server and the operating system. So on the Linux server where the IMIS is currently installed, that's the NMRC Linux server. The web server is Apache and the operating system is Debian 8. Whereas on the Linux server where um, the FEMA and um, NASCO test apps are installed. The web server is Apache and the operating system is Ubuntu 18. So you need to, you can also Google, once you log into any of the servers from your terminal, you can also Google the command on how to check the operating system name and version and run that command here and you will see the respective OS. So once you've selected this, you simply scroll down. Um, there are this, these are the steps with the codes or commands on how to install the SSL. So first of all, the first step is SSH into your server. Is it already SSH into my server? I'm using Putty, so I've used the Putty application for windows to connect to my server you need to know your server ip address username and password to achieve this once this is done the next step is to if you had a previously installed package you can remove it but there is no need for this step step three is to install the set bot application there is also no need for this step except you're using a new server because I've already installed the set bot on all our servers. So I'll skip this step. So the next step, step four, by the time you run this command in step four, you would see So once you run this command, it will, it will prompt you for your password, you put your password to provide sudo access. Then you will see a list of all the domain names tied to that server. So if you read the command underneath carefully, I say select appropriate numbers separated by comma. So if I want to renew the SSL on domain 3 on line 3 which says webapp.hela.com.ng which is the domain we are using for the IMIS. I will simply enter 3 here. I can also add multiple domains by specifying the numbers tied to them. So once you've finished this step, you just keep on following the prompt. It will ask you if you want to force redirect to that domain. You can go ahead and um, select yes and then it would have automatically renewed the SSL certificate on the domain. Then to test it, so what you need to do is um, open your browser and type in the address with HTTPS and you won't get that um, unsecure connection prompt that the browser displayed. Also, I've also tried to set up this automatic renewal on the domain so but i don't know if it's working yet so in the next um 90 days from now we'll know if this is working if the certificate was automatically renewed otherwise we'll have to set a reminder for that date and um, renew the certificate so you can set a reminder on your phone or use your um, Google Calendar app on your Gmail to set the reminder. Also, the setbot sends reminder emails. So, 
but the reminder emails will come to my email address since um, I put in my email address as the admin while installing set ports. So if I get the email address, I'll also forward them to you so as you can renew the SSL certificates. So that's just pretty much about it.